Hi everybody, uh, welcome to my channel. Um, this is just a quick video based on a thing I've just been asked um, that I've been meaning to shoot for a little while. So um, this is about signing documents with an, uh, a tablet or a phone or anything like that. Um, I have an iPad Pro here and it's got an Apple Pencil so I can sign with the pencil but you could just as easily sign with your finger so I'm gonna show you both. Um, so I've prepared a PDF um, if I open my files app if you get a PDF from a, a, an email or anything like that, you can just open it up. Um, and what you should get is the PDF itself. And in the top right hand corner here, you'll have a little pen icon and also the share icon. Um, if you, I'll leave the pencil for a minute. If you tap the pen icon, it will allow you to write over the top of the document. So you can just sign with your, with your own signature is always preferable. Um, and that will, that will work just fine. Your alternative is that, again, with the pen selected, you can just sign. I just made up the one from the name there. Um, you can sign with the pen and that works. Once you've signed the document or written over it in any way, you can also use this to highlight uh, if you want to make notes on a document to send to somebody else. Uh, so you could say needs edit, for example, um, you can do anything like that basically. Um, so there's lots of different tools here. Again, this is an iPad Pro. This works on any kind of iPad, um, but where you don't have access to a pencil because you don't own one or because it's not compatible with your device, then you can use your finger to do this as well many colors to choose from because you can get a whole palette up there um, yeah and that kind of covers the whole thing once you're happy with that um, you can hit this export or share button at the top here the universal share and then you can choose to send it to a person that you regularly contact or indeed pull it into mail it's probably the most likely uh, option that you're going to go for so if you pull it into mail it will generate an email with that and then you can send it to whoever you want that is how you sign a document digitally. Uh, I hope that's been useful. Um, it certainly is something that I've used many times. And uh, yeah, uh, I'll see you in another video. Thank you very much.